Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Christy. In today's video, I'm actually in the middle of a meal prep, but we are taking a little break so that we can eat dinner and I'm making corn on the cob and I thought, I don't think I've ever done a corn on the cob video. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to do corn on the cob in the Instant Pot. I started cooking corn on the cob in the Instant Pot probably about a year ago, and I have never done it any other way since. I love it in the Instant Pot. It is so easy to just toss it in there and let the Instant Pot do the cooking. Rather than boiling the water, worrying about if the corn on the cob sat in the water too long, got waterlogged. So come along with me and I will show you how easy this is to do in the Instant Pot. So I've got my Instant Pot here. I have the Instant Pot Duo Crisp and Air Fryer. So on um, this one, this is an eight quart. So down in the bottom of my Instant Pot, I have about one and a half cups of water. I'm gonna add some kosher salt. That just kind of helps the steam. And now I'm gonna put a trivet in there. So now I'm gonna take my corn, and as you can see, this corn looks wonderful. We live in Florida, so we are very fortunate to get some really good corn on the cob for most of the year. So this is what this looks like. I love this kind. So all we're gonna do is just line up the corn down in the bottom. It usually fits about three across, and then just put, you can fit like six in here, So, but I'm just gonna do five. So I usually do opposite directions. So the ones on top, I do opposite. Now I'm just gonna take my lid and cover it. And then make sure to put it in the sealing position. So I don't have to do that with this one, it automatically does it. We are literally gonna put this on pressure cook for on high for two minutes. So it's gonna come up to pressure. It's gonna take about 12 to 15 minutes to come up to pressure. It's gonna cook for two minutes. And then as soon as the two minutes is done, I'm gonna do a quick release on it. All right, once the two minutes is up, then just give that a quick release. After all the pressure's out, then take the lid off and it's done. I'm using this Lando Lakes light butter. I usually put the butter on the top there and then just kind of roll it around in the dish. And then add some Himalayan pink salt. And that is so good. So that's how easy it is to make corn on the cob in the Instant Pot. So I hope you all liked this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. I'm Christy and I'm planning us healthy. You are